everybody. I'm in the middle of absolutely nowhere in Ohio for a Juggalo gathering, and I am very excited. Hey, how's it going? What's up? Come here. You want you want to talk to me for a second? Uh, what what was that you said? I've been here for two minutes. This is my first interaction. I said, "Fuck her right in the pussy." Is that how you? Uh, that's is that your classic pickup thing? Ah, sometimes. Sometimes I just say, "Hey, you want to go for a pizza and fuck?" Here to here first, folks. What's like? What's a juggalo? A juggalo, uh, to me, is uh, is family. We're all we're all our own kind of lunatics, I guess. There's all kinds of shit a juggalo might be, but who the fuck really knows? You know, he might get butt naked or some shit. Might try to lick your booty hole. What's like being a juggalo mean to you? Short and simple, is someone who's down on their luck and just don't give a fuck. A juggalo is a motherfucker who's down for family. You yeah. feel me? We're yeah. down for family, down for everyone. Because when I hang out with my family, it's like a little different than, than that. Oh, yeah. My real family fucking sucks. Oh, yeah. Why? I mean, my family don't give a fuck what I do. I can tell them I'm smoking crack, they don't give a fuck. Yeah. But the juggalo shit, they're just like, whatever. The makeup do you wear that like every day or just when you're at these? It's not makeup, it's face paint. It's face paint? Yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, face paint. Yeah, warrior paint. Warrior paint. Yeah, it means I've been through some shit. Did you do some shit? Yeah, like underwear. Like underwear? Yeah, like the dirty D's. Oh, yeah. They're done dirt cheap. Yeah. I, I seem to not, I seem to have a lot to learn. This is my first year and I drove 25, 25 hours by myself straight to make it here to see ICP. Whoa. I've been down with ICP since I was uh, 13 years old. Is there anything you care about more than ICP? Honestly, there's really not. I mean, ICP is pretty much life. You got, what do you, what do you got the gasoline for? You want to smell it? Do I want to smell your, your gasoline? Yeah, maybe there's some left in there. Never been asked that before in my whole life. Gasoline <laughs> smells good. You know when you fuel up your car, it smells good. Is that why you? Is that why you smell this? I, I am. Like it's very, it's very potent. It's good. Yeah, it's very, it's very potent. Fucked gasoline. up your brain though. So how, how you guys go to this thing a lot? Um, this is our sixth year actually. Uh -huh. What's the craziest thing you've ever seen at one of these ever? A girl take a two liter of Fago up her butt at the Juggle That contest. What's the craziest thing that you've seen here? Well, Wizard of the Hood last night. That was like mind blowing. Other than that, I've seen a lot of buttholes this year. Like, like butts or like the holes? Like the holes, like straight up, like cheeks spread, like actual hole. That's wow. I, I'm sorry, like I, I, I've never gone to a social event and, and seen a single one that way. Nope. You're around Juggalos now. Was I here last night? Yeah. I missed it. What was the craziest thing that happened last night that I missed? I uh, blew up a porta potty. Wait, what? They were fucking lighting shit off in a porta potty and some bitch run out pulling up her drawers and shit. Probably shit still hanging out her fucking ass. So she blew it up or she was in there and uh, someone else. There, blew it up. She was next. She was like in the fucking porta potty right next to the joint there blowing up. And like, so when the fucking John lit up, I guess all she seen was the fucking John light up. And I'm like, while well, John was popping off, she come running out with her shit like down the here, like pulling up her John out the porta potty running. Cause. I gotta say, I've never seen anything like that. Yeah, it's the fucking gathering. But that was just funny as shit. Cause I was just wondering what was going through her head when she was taking this shit. I would have been pretty mad. I, I don't give a fuck. Fuck you, cuz don't be in the fucking porta potty, then we're blowing it up. Don't be in the porta potty when they're blowing it up. You heard it here first, folks. Yeah. Yeah. Philly, whoop whoop. You want to piss off your dad? No, I really actually like my dad. Well, you want to piss him off? You know where to find me. Well, uh, oh, to 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 have sex with you. Yeah. Oh, so that's what you do? Has, does this work ever? It's the first time I'm trying it, but. All right. Yeah. 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 All right. Okay. Yeah. If you ever want to piss him off, you know where to find me. All right. I'll think. I'll think about it. So they're doing bare knuckle around. boxing for a championship, now, and they do it every day. Tomorrow Tomorrow's gonna be the final round. How do you win? Tomorrow, I don't know if it's you knock them out, submit them, or we vote out. that they win. We'll get it all going, but come so it's back just here like, tomorrow. How do you? How is there like a timer? Like I don't. You got you got 60 seconds, three rounds each, and you just beat each other up. Living piss out of each other. You want to hang out with the jugglers on Cycle Radio, don't you? Four, three, two, one. All right. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know. Oh my god. Uh, there's two sweaty wrestling dudes and a bunch of dudes in masks in the back that I think manage a hot topic when they're not here. 
So there's you drink the frozen daiquiris over there, and then you beat the piss out of each other over here, and then here you can get yeah, some sexual harassment over here, and then some veggie burritos over there. Uh, what's the craziest thing you've seen so far? Uh, probably that girl giving a blowjob to the bl fat black dude on, on stage last night at the Mike Busey show. <laughs> Last night, at, she was just during the week, jobs to like yeah. random people on stage <laughs> last night. The, yeah, the DJ Clay battle yeah. party. At the end of it, he was he was like, "You better man. suck that dick," and she was like, "It worked." She's, <laughs> work. she's like, she's like oh, 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 yeah. She just kept going. She kept it was, going. It was like some, it was, we have an estimate. Shit, like yeah, four some, people, I think. Crazy. Four people. That's kind of that's kind of crazy. Typical 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 Thursday. Yeah. Yeah, everybody does that on Thursdays. What's the, what's the craziest thing you've ever seen at one of these? Just some people beat each other up just for the fun of it. And they, the don't, and they don't, it's just like fun? Yeah, yeah, it's all fun. You know, if somebody does get hurt too much, we're there to care about them, you know, make sure they're okay, but it's not too physical. So you like beat fun. each other up and then take care of each other? Yeah, of course. All right, it was 2012 in Hog Rock, right? We used to have this drug bridge. It was like a little bridge over a tiny creek. A drug bridge. Everyone would go. You know, sell drugs, and that's where you go to get them, right? Uh, well, there was one night I was walking through it, and I saw a line of easily 50 to 70 dudes all with their dicks out, and there was a gangbang on the drug bridge. The chick was going nuts, and not one of them was wearing a fucking condom. That sounds like the most dangerous thing I've ever heard of. Yeah, that was the most fucked up thing I ever saw. Thank you. Holy shit. Holy shit. What's good, guys? 2,000 motherfuckers, 17 motherfuckers. Ah! In the camera space. Burn the camera with me. Burn the fucking camera. All right? I'd really prefer that you did not. I'd really prefer that you did not. What are you talking about? Don't talk to this fucking camera. Yo, we hate the media. Don't say a fucking thing. What's the best thing about being a juggalo? Well, it was the best thing about being a juggalo was that nobody really knew about us. Now everybody does. Thanks to this shit. Fuck that shit. It ruined the whole juggalo world. I ruined the whole world. You know. You know. It's true. It ruined everything. This shit. Everything. The large corporate media that is Barstool Sports <laughs> ruined. <laughs> ruined. <laughs> <laughs>